the northern lights could be visible again in Tennessee tonight. News 2's Davis Nolan joins us now in studio with details. Davis. Hey, Bob and Haley. Well, you know, the words could be seen tonight are sort of very true because we've learned that this is a little bit like weather forecasting to see the northern lights this far south. It's not a perfect science, but the NOAA Weather Storm Prediction Center for the uh, space weather is forecasting a G4 severe geomagnetic storm overnight tonight. And G4 is pretty strong, as you can see. Tomorrow night, it'll only be G1. So if we do get a chance to see them, and I'll talk about this more in a moment, the northern lights may be seen tonight between sunset and 1 a.m. and look low in the horizon, outside of the city lights, as dark of a, a sky as you can get out there. Now, here's the unfortunate thing. From the same Space Weather Prediction Center people, this is where they see the best chance of seeing the northern lights up in Canada, northern U.S., and the little red line right there that goes through parts of northern Missouri, central Illinois, and Indiana, that's as far south as they say that you'll probably see them with this G4, which means Middle Tennessee and southern Kentucky gets left out. But guess what? Last Monday night, we had a G3, and we received pictures from some of our viewers. Professor from Vol State, Tim Ferriss got this incredible picture from Hendersonville of the pink lights there. He did have a long exposure on his camera. And this from James Pettis from the same G3 storm. So there is a chance that even though we're talking about a G4 that's supposed to not come this far south, we might get a shot at seeing those northern lights overnight tonight. Send pictures to pics at WKRN.com.